There we go. Nice, nice. He should be coming around here, maybe. Oh, perfect shot! Jesus, and born. It's Jason Christ. Come on. Oh, he disappeared. Nope, he's right here. I got you. Oh, I see two fuel things. There we go. Hey guys, Jeep right here. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you're all doing well today. Today we are back in Crossout and I got a very unusual build as you guys can see. And the creator called it How Pros Play XO. <laughs> it's a very unusual build, so I wanted to check it out. I'm actually gonna play another build. We're gonna play a Quasar build, this build today, because I've been running in whoever made this build and he's been kind of kicking my ass. So I kind of wanted to check this build out because it seemed pretty effective. Uh, but before we start with this build, we're going to use this build a little bit, see how it works. It does look kind of cool, <laughs> kind of looks cool, but steering is kind of odd and it kind of messes with your head and it drifts a lot. I think it would be better if you could maybe mount some wheels in the middle as well, but I don't know, it looks weird. But it has some punishers on it, and hopefully we will be able to... Oh my god, look at this guy. Let's escape before we get wrecked. Um, but yeah, this, these are the two builds we're going to use today. Let's quickly check what this thing's made of. We got two Punisher machine guns. We got one RNC seal radiator. We got a growl cabin and radios. That's basically not a lot. Four studded wheels, not a lot. So we almost got a thousand durability, so it's not too bad, but it doesn't look like it's gonna steal the episode today i think this build will be a lot more fun because that guy who kept uh <laughs> getting me with this thing like he was i was his primary target every time he saw me he would just go after me non-stop so we're gonna see how it performs and quasars are pretty good quasars are still pretty good so yeah without any further ado hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know what you think in the comment section down below don't forget to subscribe guys and yeah just sit back relax and enjoy the video all right, guys, we are at the ship graveyard. Let's get Julie real quick. You know which bot I kind of missed? That was kind of stupid, but easy to get the uh, wreck. That bot with the triple 88, that red and white bot. And whenever he would fire, he would just like do a wheelie. <laughs> I missed that bot. That bot was shoot fun to shoot because he was uh, his AI was really dumb. All right, so we're stripping these guys pretty fast. What the heck did I hit? Okay. So, not... I'm not a fan of the Punishers because... I don't know. I don't like the way it... Oh. I don't like the way it fires. But they do seem pretty okay. I only really played them when they came out. Oh, we got someone using an a Assembler. Let's finish off Race. Oh god, yep, there we go. He stripped one of my guns, got two of his guns. He should be... So the, they spread a lot, but it doesn't look like the Punishers deal a lot of damage. Like I said, haven't played the Punishers, like, ever since they came out. I played them once when they, like, released, but never touched them again. Not too bad. Try and tap fire and strip off people. Oh, there we go, never mind. It seems like everybody I shoot. Nope, oh, never mind. Come on, get ready. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Not too bad. It's not like a fun build, so. We did good. First match was good. Somehow we got MVP. Let's let's try one more. I didn't really like it. Let's try one more. All right, guys, we are at the fortress and this server feels a little bit laggy. So might not be that lucky this time around. Yeah, it feels really laggy. Like whenever I uh, do an input, on my keyboard, it just takes uh, a few seconds. Come on, get this hurricane. There we go. This guy might come after me. Yep. He is running little boys, I believe. Why is nobody focusing him? Let's 
try and do a drive-by of some sort and get this gun. Oh, what the heck? Nope, nope, nope. There we go. He's using one hammer fall. There we go. We should be able to strip it. There we go. We got it. We got it. I heard something like a spike fly by him, so let's finish him off real quick. Oh, he's pretty fast. Not anymore. Oh, wait. Let's finish this guy off. Never mind. He's gone. Oh, not a good, not good, not good. Hey, there we go. We kind of tricked them there. Come on, strip off one gun. Strip off one. There we go. We got one gun. Oh, we got someone behind us. Oh, I lost all my mobility. This guy screwed. We got... Oh, nope, nope. Oh, I'm the only guy left. Yep. Come on, come on. There we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. Oh. We did get this. Oh, oh man. We did so good. Freaking team just disappeared. Yeah, we did good. We did good. This build's actually not too bad. It's not too bad. Eh, let's play one more. All right, guys, we are at the Broken Arrow. Hope my team stays alive long enough this time so we can actually have uh, a victory. Okay, there we go. We got well, we got a lot of drone dropping bots. So let's take care of them. It spreads really quick. I think this gun will be perfect with the Guerrero cabin. I believe that's a nope, it's a cannon bot. There we go. Can't really see what I'm shooting at. There we go. Somehow we got him. I think the damage output on these is pretty high. Whenever you shoot someone, you deal a lot of damage, even though it doesn't look like it. Oof. Yep, I felt that. That damage output's also pretty high. Let's push up a little bit. Brian, get out of the way. You be my meat armor, Brian. I wanted Brian to be my meat shield. Oof, no. <laughs> up. Oh, we won. Well, this build's not too bad, but we're going to switch builds. Yeah. All right, guys, we are at the Sandy Gulf. We usually start seeing people around here. So I thought, let me just start with the commentary. There we go. Okay, okay, let's... Uh, I thought the uh, fire button was the left mouse button. It's the left. So... I haven't used squazers in a while. Elevation is pretty horrible. I thought it was better than it did. Should be a direct hit. Yep, one hit at least. Oh, what? Oh, good hit. Just one again. You know what would be cool for these weapons? The longer it flies, the uh, or with, with a cool perk. The longer it flies, the higher the damage is. It would be kind of cool to see. I am going to go finish with... It's, that was a pretty bad shot, but still 900 damage. Not too bad. Yep, there goes your frames and your drills. Wait, we got someone, I think, sniping. Beautiful hit. He screwed. Kind of predicted that shot perfectly. And I'm surprised those uh, triple crossbow didn't really flip me or do anything special. Good hit. Oh, yeah. One kind of did move me there, so it's not too bad. Not too bad. Never mind. I probably missed uh, two of them. So, so far, this build is... What's up with the elevation, though? Can't really shoot up something. Oh, that's not good. What's this guy running? Yep, get out of here. Not today, man. Not today. Oh, gosh. What? There we go. Nice, nice. He should be coming around here, maybe. Oh, perfect shot. Come on. Oh, he disappeared. Nope, he's right here. I got you. Oh, I see two fuel things. 
There we go. Beautiful. Yeah, this build's pretty good. Like, that's why I had so much trouble with this guy. Or whoever was using it. Pretty damn good build. All right, guys, welcome to the factory. I think I found the issue with the elevation. I think the bumpers are kind of blocking the weapon from aiming higher than uh, it can. Just kind of. Uh, that's the only drawback of this build, I think. Can't really aim up too high, but you know, uh oh, I got stuck by some things. These are pretty strong. I think, especially with the quantum cabin spurt. Yeah, pretty insane. We're just gonna peek. William. Oh, that's not good. Oof. William gone. Let's get out of here. I see a few people on fire. Oh, no, nope, predicted that wrong. Let's peek again. Beautiful hit. One more. Don't push him. Don't push him. There we go. Nice. One more. Yep, he's gone. Oh, he moved. No. Ooh, he's one more guy here. Ah, god dang it. Kind of difficult to predict because they're panicking. There we go. Beautiful. MVP again, getting a lot of MVPs. All right, guys, we are at the control station. I got the uh, bot locked onto me there, so that's not good. Good hit. Uh oh, what the heck? This bot's still trying to get me. Beautiful. Oh. Nice. One more. This bot must be aggroed on me as well, I think. I'm not sure. Damn, dude. Quasars? Quasars still deal a lot of damage. Dude, like, it's almost a thousand hit damage each hit. Look at that. These are purple weapons. Oh, that one was a miss, though. Somehow I got the guy behind him. Oh, that was a miss, I think. <laughs> yeah, rip him. Finish him off. We got a spike guy. Oh, spike guy over here. Oh, it's the uh, Phoenix guy. He's using Phoenix and a plasma drill thing. Oh, what the heck? I think I stripped off one. Oh, what the heck? Dude. Yeah, get out of here. I thought I heard his self-destruct sound. Could have been mistaken. Oh, low, low ammo. Okay, we need to watch our ammo. Let's just focus on someone else. Mm, they, they are on our cab. There we go. We got to assist there. We left our cab. One player left. Never mind. And I got MVP again, yeah. I think I'm gonna name this video, this is how pros play, since it's the name of the first build. Yep, easy peasy lemon squeezy. Well guys, there you have it. These were some easy matches. I didn't expect to have so much fun with these two builds. You should definitely check them out. The other one is pretty expensive because it uses two relics, but the Quasar one is pretty, I wouldn't say affordable, but they're only purple weapons, so that means you you know with a lot of grinding you can get these weapons if you prefer this type of weapon you know like energy weapons stuff like that but it's a pretty solid build i like what the creator did he it feels like he tweaked it played this build for a very long time i think the only thing i would switch is these two ammo boxes with a purple one to uh you know just because these ones if they you know get hit they blow up pretty fast other than that, this build's perfect. Perfect power score, perfect durability. Everything is well, not really perfect. It's only a thousand, but it's only a thousand. But you do have like um, I think almost a thousand in the front as well. Because there's 200, 200, 400, like eight hundred, and then you got a bunch of 
uh, blades in the front. So we get around 800 armor in the front, and then the build itself is like around a thousand. So that's not too bad. But anyways, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I kind of want to play this build more. Anyways, I'm talking too much. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one. Subscribe and like the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a great day. Peace out.